Hey guys, welcome back. So right now we are in the hidden forest in the Ashina Depths region and in this video we will be facing the mini boss headless demon. Uh, let me just show you how to reach here. See this is the Ashina Depths region and this is the hidden forest. So guys there are uh, in all 5 headless demons and killing them will give us spirit fall which are an alternative to the sugar candies which we use more often. Uh, but facing these uh, headless mini bosses is totally optional and uh, it doesn't affect the course of the game even if we kill or don't kill them. And before facing them, see these mini bosses are very strong. So I'll just suggest you guys one thing that uh, we reach at least the Mibu village area before facing them. Uh, because by that time we will be having sufficient vitality and items to face them. Okay, so before so this is the uh, headless demon and before facing him we'll just check the items which we need. So this is a phoenix lilac umbrella and it pre prevents the apparition attack, the sword attacks. It will pr um, protect us basically, our vitality. This is the malcontent ring. It is a very important item because it has the ability to stun any apparition type enemies. But there is a catch. We can use it only three times. So make sure to use it properly. I'll use it in the second phase because this headless is having two life bars and they are capable of causing terror buildup so we will be using this mottled purple gold during the battle and an item we can consume which will reduce the terror buildup is the pacifying agent uh, let me check where is it pacifying agent yeah so before facing him, I will just consume this pacifying agent, this divine confetti to boost our attack and an echo sugar candy to further boost our attack. And remember guys while facing any apparition type enemy, use the divine confetti because if we don't use it, we can't cause any vitality damage to them. So now I will just go ahead and start attacking him. Uh, see whenever he will do this revolving sword revolving attack after that he will disappear and will reappear again behind our back yeah so now he is going to there he is but now we will use the malcontent ring to stun him And yeah, just like that, we have defeated the headless. And we acquire this Gachin Spirit Fall. So guys, this Spirit Fall are uh, just like the un unlimited supply of sugar candies. We can use them instead of the sugar candies. But it will consume Spirit Emblems. So as long as we have Spirit Emblems, we can use that Spirit Falls. And those spirit falls will be very helpful when we face the main bosses because those will be very long battles and we have to use the sugar candies multiple times. So yeah guys that was the headless demon in the hidden forest. So yeah that's it for this video. Adios and take care.